Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. I'm Dave from TwoAverageDudes.com. So, recently I was out in the East Coast for a little while, and while I was in the Maritimes, and well, I shouldn't say all the Maritimes, I was in New Brunswick and Nova Scotia, and I, I took the time out to ask people, and I did a little poll, and I did one in Quebec also, and I'll get to that in another day. I'm still putting the numbers together for that, but I got the numbers together for what I did. So. I polled 2,207 people. I literally went up and asked them. 2,207. Now, the vote would go, the Liberals would get 17%, uh, Conservatives 56%, NDP 4%, and I think there was uh, 12% uh, they didn't know, and the rest said they weren't voting. So they didn't want to vote. They didn't feel good about anybody. And, of course, I went on about the importance of voting, but, you know, it's their own choice. So, 56% conservative. Woohoo! That's good news, right? So, now, I asked another question. Do you trust Justin Trudeau? Yes, was 21%. No, was 66%. And the rest didn't know. They, they had no feeling either way. 66% of Canadians that I polled in New Brunswick and Nova Scotia did not trust the Prime Minister. That's disgusting. And that just shows what kind of a, a moron, globalist, lying person he actually portrays himself to Canadians as. Who he is. He is that type of person that people do not trust. Now... Voting, 56% conservative. That That's great news. That, that I think, is great news because it shows that they're going to get rid of the liberals. And, now, I spent a lot of time on this. And, like, as in any poll, you know, it could be completely wrong. I, I try to get people in different areas and everything else. So, I had a wide range. You know, it's not just one area that's maybe all conservative. I didn't, I didn't background check or anything. I just went and asked people as I went along. And I was quite shocked at the dislike for Trudeau. Honestly, I was. I wasn't actually expecting these results. And uh, when I put together the numbers for Quebec, um, I think I'll be surprised at the outcome of that too. Anyway, guys, uh, what do you think? Aren't you happy about this? I know I am. Mike, what's your take on all these numbers? Dave, there's not much for me to say here. The numbers speak for themselves. What's this, what this shows is that Canadians don't trust Justin Trudeau and a bunch of them want to see the government uh, changed. They, they think it's time for a change and they're tired of Trudeau and uh, your polling and your numbers show exactly that. So this is exactly the news we were hoping for. This is great news. This is what we've been fighting for. This is what we've been broadcasting on. And this is what we've been informing the people on to get this point where people don't trust Justin Trudeau because they shouldn't and the fact that people want to see a change in the government. So, our work is working. There's still a long way to go. You know, 2,200 people is a good survey. It's not everybody, but it's a good survey. You did a great job, Dave, doing all that and all that poem while you're out there. And the numbers are promising. The numbers are hopeful. And it's great to see. I'm pretty excited at what we've got going on here, guys. You know, let us know what you think. Post your comments below if you think we're on the right track and, and Dave's poll's accurate. And, and it looks like people don't just don't trust Justin Trudeau and they want to see the government go. So check out our website, toaveragedudes.com. Check out our polls and surveys and all the fun stuff. And we'll catch you next time, guys.